Hello friends welcome to our channel today we are presenting class 3 science chapter 8 solids liquids and gases so let us start name the three different forms of water shown in the picture so first of all we have water in form of gas this is steam s t e a m steam water in solid form so this is ice water in liquid form so this is water w a t e r here ice is solid water is liquid and steam is gas solids liquids and gases are three forms of matter now what is matter matter everything around us is an example of matter matter is anything that has mass and takes up space let us study in detail about the different forms of matter first of all solids things that have a fixed shape and size and take up a fixed space are known as solids for example tables chairs trees and phones so example of solids here in this picture are a chair and a dice now liquids things that do not have a fixed shape or size but take up a fixed space and can flow easily are known as liquids for example milk juice and water liquids take the shape of the container they are kept in we can see examples of liquids milk water juice etc now gases things that do not have a fixed shape or size and do not take up a fixed space are known as gases they cannot be seen steam is made of hot water vapor water vapor is the gaseous state of water oxygen is also a gas gas takes the entire space of the container it is present in we can see an example of gases the water vapor Milk is a liquid. What will it become after being kept in the freezer for about 2 to 3 hours? Liquid or solid? So because milk will freeze, this will become solid. Now this is a table. Complete the differences between solids, liquids and gases in the table given here. We have solid, liquid and gases. Number 1, solids have a fixed shape and size. whereas liquids do not have any fixed size but they take shape of the container gases do not have any fixed shape and size now second solids do not flow liquids flow easily gases flows very easily third solids cannot be poured into containers liquids take up the shape of container and gases take up the entire space of container number 4 examples of solids are table chair etc Examples of liquids are water, milk, etc. Examples of gases are hydrogen, oxygen, carbon dioxide, etc. Now, change of form. Matter can change from one form to another. This is called change in the state of matter. For example, water can be changed from one form to another. water that is liquid changes to ice that is solid upon freezing ice that is solid melts into water liquid upon heating this is known as melting when water liquid is heated for a very long time it changes into water vapor that is gas this is known as the process of evaporation water vapor is the gaseous form of water we can see through this picture if we put a plate over the water vapor gas the water vapor cools down and tiny droplets of water liquid form on plate this process is known as condensation 
Now let us see through this picture changes in the states of matter we can see solid in ice on heating that is melting becomes water which is liquid then when water is heated it evaporate and gives vapor that is gas water vapors now when water vapor are cooled down these are water vapors when they are cooled down this process is known as condensation and they become liquid and liquid further when cooled down it freeze down to a solid this process is freezing now can a substance change from a solid to gaseous state directly if yes name the process so yes dry ice changes from solid to gaseous state directly and this process is known as sublimation now check point match the following so number 1 solid so solid has mass and occupies space number 2 water vapor so water vapor are gaseous state number 3 liquid liquid can flow number 4 matter so matter does not change shape and ice is a frozen water now we have keywords now matter anything that has mass and takes up space is known as matter solids things that have a fixed shape and size are solids liquids things that do not have a fixed shape or size and can take up the shape of the container gases things that do not have a fixed shape or size and can take up all the available space freezing the process in which a liquid changes to a solid on cooling melting the process in which a solid changes into a liquid upon heating evaporation the process in which a liquid changes into a gaseous state upon heating for a longer time condensation the process in which a gaseous state changes into the liquid state upon cooling so these are keywords now let us see summary of the lesson everything around us is known as matter solids liquid and gases are three states of matter they can be changed from one form to another solids have a fixed shape and size liquids do not have any fixed shape they take the shape they are poor into hence they flow easily gases do not have any fixed shape or size they flow very easily now exercise number 1 objective type questions a tick the correct answer number 1 anything that has mass and takes up space is known as c matter so anything that has a mass and takes up space is known as matter c second which of the following is not a state of matter so solid liquid and gases are states of matter so shadow is not a state of matter so c option is correct number 3 deepa heated water for a very long time she saw gas rising up this process is known as evaporation d option evaporation number 4 tiny droplets of water are formed through the process of b condensation condensation number 5 which of the following is a state of matter so we can say all of these are states of matter b complete the concept map now question b complete the concept map so we have states of matter types so we have three types of states of matter solid s o l i d solid liquid l i q u i d liquid and gas g a s gas example of solid art for example toothbrush car etc example of liquid drain milk paint etc example of gas are bug spray perfume etc now number c identify the states of matter solid liquid or gas so first of all we have ice which is solid so we write s for solid second we have kerosene which is liquid so we write l 3 oil which is liquid number 4 3 is solid number 5 so this is smoke which is gaseous so we write g 
number six we have tea so this is liquid number seven we have water vapor so this is gas number eight we have eraser this is solid number nine we have soap liquid soap so l short answer questions define matter so everything which takes up space is known as matter evaporation when liquid is changes into gaseous state this process is known as evaporation condensation when gas form change into liquid that is known as condensation freezing when liquid changes into solid then this process is known as freezing number two give two examples each of three different forms of matter so we have solid like chair and dice liquid like soap liquid soap and oil and gases like we have bug spray and uh, perfume number three write one difference between melting and evaporation so melting when some solid thing changes into liquid this is known as melting evaporation when liquid changes into water vapor this is known as evaporation what causes a solid to melt into a liquid so when we give energy in form of heat then solid changes into a liquid so this is the end of the chapter solid liquid and gases so friends if you like the video then please like and share the video and do subscribe our channel thanks for watching the video and keep watching for more such videos thank you